Hello everybody, this is your friendly neighbor Lisa Foxy, and welcome back to Honkai Star Rail. So, uh, we're gonna carry on with the story, uh, which I gotta make sure I get back to it, because I was kind of leveling up a little bit. Didn't get kinda really lucky yet with the, um, with the card. I had the five-day thing. However, I did, I accidentally invested one of them into the wrong thing. But I still ended up getting, like, March, which is fine, because I wanted to level her up, too. Or get at least her el uh, Elon thing to E6. So, right now she's at, like, E5, which is fine with me. But, uh, I'm pretty happy and excited, and I hope you guys will be excited and happy as well If I, whenever, when I get the card. I still haven't given up on that, either. But uh, I just wanted to carry on and uh, today, this morning, and do the story. I still got a little bit of little points that I saved up from the game. Just a little bit. Just hopefully to pull. Uh, and plus the free ones that they give us. So, a little bit here and there. All right. So yeah, back to Jingyuan. I must return to my quarters now. I merely took advantage of the healer's absence to slip out and relax a little. <sighs> Be on your way. All right, so be on our way. And I also leveled up um, Dong Hang uh, a little bit. And I am using a different card. Which, also, I was leveling that up as well. Though it may not be his main card. But this card is still pretty useful when using it. So he is almost ready to be... Uh, his This card is ready to almost to be maxed up. So I am planning to do that as well today as well. So, um, see if I can exchange some of this to just kind of get there halfway. All right. Okay, hold on to me. I'm working on it. <laughs> Max this out. And then I have to go back because I gotta remember how many. So seven. It needs seven. Oh, so close, but not close enough. Okay. Which is fine. I think we can still kind of exchange some uh, material that I have. So, five... 
Well, this probably still won't be enough because I, I still need to uh, get more. Try this. And... This is kind of what I do. I just kind of go in here and... Oops. And just kind of craft stuff. And hope it will be enough. Because eventually when I... Max things out, so five... Uh, six, seven, eight. When I have enough, then, you know, I start maxing out my character from there. I, oh, I accidentally went over. My bad. <laughs> anyway, so. Well, that's what you do. Nine. Okay. So, at least this card will be level 80. It will be ready. And, uh... As you can see, all my other cards that I've collected. But these are pretty use useful. Uh, my relic sets and stuff are not quite there yet. But uh, I am planning to get his actual proper gear um, as well. Um, but other than that, so the tracers are still not quite maxed. So I have to get all the good materials in order to do the uh, really some really good damage uh, and stuff. So, But... At least I get his cone up to 80. It probably won't be too much of a struggle. So I'm looking forward to that while leveling up at the same time my character. And uh, hopefully getting his card as well along the way. If I don't get any little hiccups. I was like, did I do that? Okay, but anyways. Master Don Hung, you're back. Have you made your decision? Will you come with me to meet with the elders first? Or are you set on seeing Miss Bailu? Miss Bailu is already waiting at Scale Gorge Waterscape. <sighs> your stubbornness is redolent of your previous incarnation. Sorry, but you're not going anywhere. A criminal who destroyed our succession is unworthy of setting foot in the sacred places of the Vidyonara. Wait. Master Don Hong's presence at Scale Gorge Waterscape has been approved by the six charioteers and the preceptors. He is no longer the criminal he once was. <sighs> Empty rhetoric. There are ways of unearthing his true identity. And even his reincarnation should answer for the monstrous crimes of the past. The Vidyatara will never accept him. <sighs> Die, Don Duan. Man, they still want him dead. Heaven search. Do you say Don Fung was merely your previous incarnation? How then do you still possess the power of the High Elder? The strength. Awaken dormant scales. World cleansing dragon. As I expected, Don Fung. You have returned. Thank you for rescuing me, Master Don Hung. They came for me. I... I'm sorry you got dragged into it. It's risky to remain here. 
We should leave. Master Don Hung, after your meeting, will you go with me to see the elders? <sighs> should I ever want to meet the preceptors, Miss Huan Si? I will ask you to pass on the message. <sighs> I understand. Please alight, Your Highness. Miss Bailu awaits you at Dragon Vista Rain Hall. Yeah, let's go. Could be dangerous ahead. We should proceed carefully. <sighs> All right. Oh, and we get a little bit of good stuff here. Who should I really bring? Mm. All right. I want to see what the details they use for him. Oh well, they wait, are they using the same details as I am? That's okay. No, they're not. Okay, so this is what they recommend. And eight. Okay. Compared to mine, mine's is not using that. Uh, but at least I have the right card. So the trial version of him. Um, we'll see if his card. His card is almost at seventy-eight. That's actually pretty good, too. So, I guess I don't mind carrying his card, even though my Dang Hung is already at level 80. But, this has probably better care. I mean, well, it does, apparently. But, um, you know what, I'll just go with mine for now. So, I'll get my regular team. I'll add Blade. Laucha and gonna use probably her silver wolf and then I'll use dang hung's his character and then I'll just carry on and I think I can kind of handle the team whatever's in here with that because silver wolf she's maxed she's got everything kind of maxed for her but she's very squishy. I should really gear her, like, super good. Okay, so she's been waiting for us. Everyone on their way here wanted to chat with Dang Hong. Hello, there. Oh. Uh, apparently, I guess there's no voice for her today. Hello there, Angel. Long time no see. What are you doing here? We're he we were met by an assassin on our way over, miss. An assassin? Are you okay? Are you injured? Fortunately, the skill of Master Dang Hang and his friend were too much for them. There are those that wish to assassinate Den Master Dang Hang, miss, presumably to preserve your legitimacy as High Elder. I don't care about my legitimacy. Why do they? I told you. Whoever wants to be the High Elder is welcome. I never wanted the title. I am Deng Hung. It's an honor to meet you, Miss Bailey. You're Deng Hung? I heard about 
how you parted the ancient sea in uh, Scale Scourge Waterscape. The assassins have to get their work cut out for them. Miss Bailey, please don't say things like that. Let me take a look at you. Dragon horns? Well, they say you're Dang Fang reincarnation, I suppose. It must be true, then. But you're different from me. Where's your tail? If I let you be the High Elder, will you grow a tail? About the High Elder succession, I have no intention of getting entangled in that. I'm here to repair the Investorial Arbor Seal. This is the duty of the Lafu Videra. Oh, really? Then why did you come see me? All I've learned since my hatching rebirth are some medical skills, alchemy commission. I can't repair cells or part the sea like you can. I should take this opportunity to talk to you about the past, Miss Bailey. I've heard about your situations, and while I can while I can't guarantee a solution, I will do my best to improve things for you. Hmm, interesting. You're not like the other grown-ups. You say what you think, and seems trustworthy. So, you want me to go with you to Scale Gage... Ah, the Scale Gorge Waterscape. Precisely. Then, let's go! Ah, Miss Feilu. Hongxi, please wait here for me. I'll come back as soon as I can. I've got these two to look after me. Don't worry. Okay. <sighs> wow, what a magnificent sight. Is this the Ambis... Ambersial Arbor? Yes. Formal seal using their power to curb and spread the ambassador root is the important task entrust to the Lafu High Elder. News to me, the Elder must be well aware that I'm not qualified for this position. Which begs the question, why did Dan Don Fang choose me all those years ago? That's exactly what I've come to Scale Gorge Waterscape to find out. Among the Videra, the High Elder is to exist closest to the Primates. According to the historical records, the High Elder succession involves secret ritual known as the Transmutation, Acarim, as well as the treasure known as Dragon's Heart. Once succession is complete, the former High Elder undergoes a hatching rebirth while the new High Elder begins to display dragonic features. However, Deng Fang's ritual failed and his powers remained within me, and yet for some reason it also created you. So, in the medical terms, he messed up the prescription and brought suffering down on himself and just about everyone else in the process. I want to use this opportunity to repair the Ambersial Arbor Seal to see if I can help recall our memories. Oh boy. Shun the tree's growth, the residual plague, water of the ancient sea. Upon the High Elder's command, subdue the eternal roots. Strange. This is different from the breaking of the seal. Why is there no reaction? What's wrong? Not going to plan, huh? Shun the tree's growth. The residual plague. Shun the tree's growth. The residual plague. <sighs> Water of the ancient sea. sea. Upon, Upon the high, high elder's command. command. Subdue the, the eternal roots. roots.
this feeling. That, that's it. You did it. This alone should prove everyone that you are the true High Elder. When the seal was reestablished, did you recall anything? Um, it was like a tide surging through my mind. I became really, really huge, and the whole scale gorge waterscape was responding to my voice, resonating with me. Yeah, that was fun, Dang, Dang Hang, Dang Hang. Sorry. <laughs> Teach me another trick. Let's see if I can remember anything else. Wait, Angel, can you feel it? There's someone coming. You, who are you? Well then, already. Protect my loops. I'm gonna do a little auto, cause... Yeah. Cause my sets are pretty much ready. used a cloud him to create mist and provide a smoke screen. Uh, I'm afraid this ambush was probably lying in wait for us. <sighs> Seems like some people have had enough of my presence. Was the assassin sent by the... <sighs> if I'm their target, why would they come after Bailu? Hmm... <laughs> We don't know how many there are. Let's get out of here. Go! Alright. Look! Look at that shadow! Could it be an assassin? Don't worry. Those things aren't hostile. This power... It rivals the tidal forces in Scale Gorge Waterscape. Is that you, Don Pung? Have you returned? I'm afraid you have the wrong person. These floating shadows are called Mirage Echoes. They are memories of past lives and echoes from the past that the Vidyadara shed during their rebirth. The books say that these mirages only speak to people they can recognize. And the water on their bodies can be used as medicine. <laughs> Seems this mirage mistook me for Don Fung. There's no mistake. This old man would recognize your voice anywhere. <laughs> Have you come to this sacred place to repent? The proud son of the Vidyadara. Hero of the High Cloud Quintet! <laughs> you fought with us your whole life! How far you have fallen. You availed yourself of the Transmutation Arcanum to summon that draconic abomination and almost laid waste to Scale Gorge Waterscape in the process! If your allies hadn't united to slay it, then the abomination would have destroyed the Ambrosial Arbor Seal. Tell me, did it sadden you to watch the abomination perish? As the High Elder, you should have freed us from the plight of rebirth and set foot on a brand new path. But instead, you were seduced by your reputation and abandoned yourself. Counted CM Joe Natives and even short life species among your friends. The upcoming trial is your final chance. Hand over the secrets of the Transmutation Arcanum now, 
And the preceptors can help you keep your secrets. Our laws could have seen you executed. Pity that the High Elder Succession could not be allowed to die with you. Kylorum Venti of the Yao Ching put forward a strong case for you, and the Ten Lords Commission spared you from capital punishment. But the punishment of Molting Rebirth could not be avoided. Elder, look around you. You've long since reincarnated. What remains here are just the mirages of the waters of the ancient sea. Impossible. I, I still live! The High Elder Succession will not be severed in this generation! I don't like this mirage echo. He thought that the Vidyadara was superior to other races, and that he was superior to other Vidyadara. <laughs> As if the Vidyadara would never progress without their plans. <laughs> I guess Danfeng probably never told them the secret of the transmutation Arcanum. We shouldn't linger here. The assassins are using skilled cloud hymn magic to make themselves invisible. But their presence is all too real. These mirage echoes, on the other hand, are vestiges of the past. If we can center and transmit the echoes, we should be able to detect any assassins hidden beneath the surface of the water. Let's look for mirage echoes and send out pulses. Move carefully. Right. So the assessors that are using Cloud Him are in stealth mode and are difficult to detect after being attacked by an enemy in stealth mode entering battle. All enemies' attacks are greatly advanced and their weakness are hidden. Using Mirage Echolocation can detect the enemies in stealth mode. Advance, there is a cooldown time after ability is used. Oh, I can't. Oh, okay. Well, that's gonna be a problem. Hold on. And... Oof. If that lagged... <laughs> that was not all part of my plan. Careful. They're waiting for us to get close enough to reveal our weak spots. Awaken Thorman Scales. World Cleansing Dragon. I was gonna do like my own thing with it, but Time for a buzz. <laughs> your end approaches. <laughs> Nothing eternal sleep. The dead return. was debating. I was like, do I want to go hill or not? Couple of assassins that way. Optimizing. <laughs> this is double speed. The fight is set. Let's settle this. Too little. Nothing made. 
danger. That paradise may be unreachable. Savor it for me. <laughs> the strength. You took the bait. Time for a bug. <laughs> you impede me. Failed to set you. Awaken dormant scales. World cleansing dragon. <laughs> Receive divinity. Do not fret. Repay. Eternal sleep. The dead return. A little close for comfort there. <laughs> I sense a storm. Heaven search. Rise. Huh. More enemies. <laughs> Consequences are mine to bear. Miss Byron, you fled the Alchemy Commission yet again. How many times have I told you our rules state that? Sorry, I'm sorry. I won't do it again. Wait, I remember that voice. That's the old Chief Alchemist. So she's been reborn? Reborn? <laughs> More excuses. Who brought you out this time? Is that Master Don Fong? <laughs> I don't think so. The appearance of the Law Fu's High Elders have been similar through the ages. But there's no mistaking Master Don Fong. Bailu, return to the Forbidden Residence. I must speak with Master Don Fong. Oh, okay. W wait, no! You were just a mirage echo! Uh, I got tricked again! Master Don Fong, I finally understand your plan. That little girl is the key to the Transmutation Arcanum. This is a breakthrough for my research. The Vidyatara performs self-reincarnation, but we are unable to reproduce. Natural and artificial disasters inevitably reduce our population. If this continues, one day our noble draconic bloodline will perish, and the fated decree of the permanence will be violated. For this very reason, I have spent my entire life researching ways to free the Vidyatara from the cycle of reincarnation. I have been without success for a long, long time, thinking that this reincarnation had been naught but a waste. But now, you have enlightened me. Don't fung. What did he do? Master Don Fung, your changes to the Transmutation Arcanum created a draconic abomination that wreaked great destruction. But it also created a new life. This is the hope that will one day allow the Vidyatara to reproduce. Understanding of reproduction was limited by ordinary notions. <laughs> How constrained I was! Why should Vidyatara reproduction remain trapped within the confines of our race? To unearth the potential might of Long's blood and incorporate other races into the flesh of the dragon, isn't that the real meaning behind the transmutation arcanum? The preceptors are too narrow-minded to see your talent. They want to install another High Elder. <laughs> Foolish! What does she mean by that? The Transmutation Arcanum seems to contain a secret that allows the Vidyatara to escape the cycle of reincarnation and return to normal reproduction. <sighs> but the mechanism eludes me. Let's go. 
Okay, I'll just let it kind of do manually from here. Ready, well, got through that. That's a good thing. My lovely brain almost was like, <laughs> it's like, oh, yeah, we need to do this. Deal with this guy. World cleansing dragon. Time for a fun. <laughs> Your end approaches. Receive divinity. The dead return. <laughs> What an explosion. Miss Byron, what are you doing in my pharmacy? Don't tell me you've already heard about Sanctus Medicus. Have you come here to condemn me? Seems like none of the Mirage Echoes realize that they've already been reborn. They're mere fragments stripped from the lives of the Vidyatara. I have never believed in the High Lord. You are unworthy of the condemnation you spout. Especially you, Miss Bailu. You simply do not have the power of the High Elder, the power to summon the forces of nature. Why should I believe you are superior in any way to Master Dom Fong? The priests, our people, they think the High Elder is the Vidyatara's only savior. <laughs> Elegant, illogical. Have you seen what merciful medicus can do? The Vidyatara already have the mortal bodies. What they should pray for is the ability to reproduce like the Sienjo natives. Merciful Medicus will help us to grow our population and bear descendants. They can do what the High Elder cannot. One day you will come to know that I was right. I never knew the Vidyatara had believers in the plagues author among their ranks.
This Mirage Echo, he must be a Cloud Knight who fought alongside Don Fung all those years ago. How many of us perished in that disaster and could not be reincarnated? And I, my leg was torn off by that abomination. Oh, the pain. The doctors at the Alchemy Commission said I have to reincarnate as soon as possible to avoid affecting my immortal life. But my poor comrades have no chance of returning to the ancient sea. You once told us that we should cherish every life cycle, and that you would use cloud hidden magic to heal our wounds. But in the end, all you did was betray us. I must listen to him very carefully. We cannot afford to miss any information. I will never forgive you. The High Elder's power belongs to the Vidyadara of the Lawfu. You are unworthy. The Vidyadara must not sever the High Elder's succession tradition just because of you. Hand it over. Dunhong. Price we pay for bearing the power of the High Elder? Carrying the weight of all these expectations. All this hatred. Before any of this transpires, you have enough time to prepare. Better wait for the cooldown in case. That's what I get for admiring. <laughs> I was like, oh, let's just admire. Oh dear. That was a mistake. <laughs> the thing was, I was uh, trying to see the earring, if he had the same earring as well. Alright. Miss Bai Lu, are you okay? I was so worried. Yuan Li! Is that you? I thought something must have happened to you. It's me, Miss Bai Lu. I'm so sorry that I can't be your maid anymore. But I heard that a smart and talented replacement would be coming soon. Yes, I suppose. 
Perhaps you must have met her already. I hope she is more competent than I was. The preceptors are very fearful of you, Miss Bailu. They asked every maid to record your dreams and daily activities. And I did so at first. After a while, I felt that the preceptors were asking this not out of concern for you, but for some malevolent purpose. So, I stopped. Yenny, don't worry. I never told anyone about my dreams. Good, good. Then I needn't worry. They'll be assigning me to a different job soon. I hope we have another chance to see each other one day. Yes. So long. Yes. Let's keep going. I see you, but... Got you. Anyway, so I was looking at the earring. I meant to go back to that. The earring uh, that um, Blade had. And I was trying to see if Dang Dung Hung had the same thing, but I don't think so. Though he does have one earring on the other side, so... Hmm. Get it in time. There we go. there. Miss Bailu, are you okay? You were in there for such a long time. Luckily, I had Dan Hong and him to protect me all the way. If anyone's owed a thanks, it's them. I didn't expect those assassins to be so brazen and reckless, storming a sacred place like Scale Gorge Waterscape and pursuing you. Rest assured, Miss Bailu, I'll report them to the elders and round them all up. Fortunately, the three of you were blessed by the gods. If anything had happened to you, it would have been a dereliction of duty on my part. Assassins. None of us mentioned that the danger involved assassins. How did you know that? Oh, it's because we were already attacked at the ferry, no? I was just worried that those people would try and attack you again. You said those assassins only came from Mr. Dan Hung. But the ones we met in the ruins were coming from me instead. <laughs> Perhaps the real dereliction of duty was that not enough happened to you. Hmm. So, did the Elder send you to take out the unworthy High Elder? <laughs> that was my idea alone. 
How could the Preceptors have come up with that? From my perspective, the Vidyadara requires only one High Elder. A second High Elder, one who is weak and useless, must be removed. Miss Bailu, our relationship as mistress and maid ends here. Farewell. Oh dear. Oh, and we got Bailu, okay. The ready. Here we go. Oh, Ding Hung. Or, I mean, Ding Yuen. Reinforcements. I am the reinforcements. <laughs> Dang. I am the reinforcements. Show no mercy. Uh, yeah, he is. Lance of Lays. Knew he was going to call more. Alright. Just going to focus on the boss. Blood cleansing dragon. A 
foregone conclusion. <laughs> Show no mercy. Yeah! Nice teamwork. Nice. <laughs> A pity. <laughs> so close. <laughs> Did the preceptors truly believe that nobody knew of their scheme? They should return to their senses. Attacking the Dragon Lady only destroys what little prestige they have remaining. The whole thing was planned by me and me alone. Beware of false charges, General. Save your breath. We all know the truth once the Cloud Knights send you to the Ten Lords Commission's judges. <sighs> Too late, Jin Yuan. I go no further. Oh. And she fell to the floor. Useless in the eyes of the elders. A false dragon who failed to inherit the power of the High Elder. And today I realize they'll use any means of removing me. Not all of the Vidyadra harbor evil intentions. If you feel uneasy, Dragon Lady, the Seed of Divine Foresight can arrange for you to stay elsewhere. Thank you, General. I'd like to talk more with Dan Hung first. Very well. I will await all of you at the fair. The Vidyadara have neither parents nor family members. Once born, the teacher is assigned to instruct the young Vidyadara in the art of Cloudhim, as well as various life skills. Dunhong, did you have a teacher like that? If you're asking about Vidyadara tradition, I'm afraid that's something I never had any experience of. I've always been a wanderer. I... I can never return to my homeland. In my fragmented dreams, I meet enemies on the battlefield. But in my travels, I meet many people who I can describe with the word teacher. As I can remember, I've had the preceptors and alchemy commission healers telling me what to do. Cure diseases, save lives. I don't know if that counts as teaching. You know something? It feels like you're the teacher I've been waiting for. Virtuous in the past life, master in the next life. Perhaps we were friends or disciples in our previous incarnations. <laughs> A friend or disciple of Don Fung? Maybe. Miss Bai Lu. At first, I was worried that your title of High Elder was in name only, and that an absence of true power would eventually put you in grave danger. <laughs> it seems I was overthinking things. You have no shortage of true power. You mean the power to repair the seal? The power you taught me? The Mirage Echoes of Scale Gorge Waterscape mentioned that not only was Don Fung a brave warrior, he could heal others with Cloud Him magic. What you have is the power of the High Elder that belongs to you. The power of life that can reforge the Arbor Seal and the vitality of the Eternal Roots. <laughs> it is a world away from my power of destruction. Danfeng probably had a gentle side to him, too, right? <laughs> Perhaps. Hmm. We should head back to the healer's market. I have other things to do today. Let's go. All right.
Now that the seal is repaired, my affairs on the Xianzhou have drawn to an end. Uh, for the time being. Oof, that loading. Are you planning on staying on the law, Fu? The banishment decree has been revoked. Oh, man. There now we go. that the seal is repaired, my affairs on the Xianzhou have drawn to an end. Uh, for the time being. Are you planning on staying on the law, Fu? The banishment decree has been revoked, and the preceptors have regained an awareness of the situation. This is your chance to return to your homeland. As a nameless, <laughs> the Express still needs me. Ah, that is a pity. <laughs> All right. Oh, and I got Sandra. Got a little message there. Hello, Angel. I'm Guan Jin. A realm keeping commission, orderly of the Scale Gorge Water Delve. I've heard a lot about you from ex excel Exhalating Sanctum Realm Keeping Commission. And got your contact detail from them. Am I in trouble? <laughs> uh, don't worry. I just have something for you. Recently we got reports of some civilians who've entered an unknown area encountered monsters that came... that can become invisible. Is it the Vidura? I know the... Cloud him magic of the Vidura can uh, conceal their form. That's not it, right? I didn't think you were so familiar. Oh god. The hypeness of the text. Okay. I didn't think you'd be so familiar with the Vidura cloud him magic. That makes it much easier for me to explain what's going on. I'm a Vidia myself. What's happen happening here is similar to the cloud him magic. But not completely identical. It's hard to explain everything over text. Let's face to face. Come whenever you have the time. I'll be the be at the Healer's Market of Alchemy Commission. Okay, so that's these three things I still have to deal with. And this one. But I'm pretty sure I will do that on my own time for sure. And... Uh, I see there's a general. I think I should refrain from violating the healer's orders any further. <sighs> the weariness is creeping up on me once again. <laughs> Time to lie down. Farewell, all of you. Something investigating. The lunar sent deaths. The Sake, scared and incorruptible holy water of the Vidura remains calm and peaceful even today. It is said that the water ancient sea has special medical properties. Not only can it be used in elixir, crucible refining medicine, but it also serves an anti-knock against Suppress and shock and popping during the quenching process in theory. You can destroy dangerous package Jing here. Are you serious? The package contains many neutron bombs. Yes, the water lunar crescent deaths have flame redundant anti knocking properties, but the body of the water is also sacred water. Life of the Vidura people, the symbol of their ancient beliefs. Do you have the heart to desecrate their beliefs and weapons with mass destruction? Are you willing to break it? This peaceful tranquility? Do it. Do it. You? No, you can't. This is immoral. If you insist on destroying the bomb here, you need six praise high mortal. Nothing less than six, do you understand? Do I look like an immoral person? 
Okay, in theory, it should be safe. What? You actually have six sprays by more? <laughs> Alright, there's nothing else I can say. I, a promise is a promise. Go do what you have to do. But remember this. Do it at your own risk. Okay. And what happens? Nothing happened. What did you think was going to happen? A massive explosion blasting a gigantic hole on the Alchemy Commission 12? Or even Jen Lafu? The best outcome for you would be to watch it silently sink in the water. Maybe see a few bubbles rise up at best. Isn't that enough? But this is not how the script's supposed to go. What script? Don't be silly. There's no script in your life. No life is scripted ex except the script writers. <laughs> All right, let's just get let's just leave it at that. Consider the outcome wasn't bad. I'll return your three praise high morals to you. You're welcome. It's nothing. If you really want to thank someone, go thank the Vidra. Thank them for not having a bone to pick with you. It should be done, like General Yang said. Update Quizna's regards this. <laughs> Oh lord. Okay, so I got my little achievements. And assignments, I'll get to that as well, and then I'll use whatever I got and try to pull for the card. And maybe it will give me some happiness? Maybe? Iffy? 50-50. Because eventually, I will end up doing this on my own time. Um, but... I know there's a story for Luca. But I think I'll do that next time on the next episode. <laughs> Possibly. We'll see. If not, then that's okay. At least I will keep you guys informed of what happens next definitely so uh, I'm gonna go ahead as you guys hear me stretch and wake up <laughs> um, I'm gonna go and see if I can get lucky with his card here so let's go ahead and use the one that I got if I got his card I'll be very happy grace me with his card no <laughs> Ah, the RNG. Alright. And then... Still got... One extra. Ah. Oh man, his card... Is like a, like a Kafka moment. Only Kafka came a little faster for me. Well, that's alright. If you guys still enjoyed this, please remember to hit that like button and please be sure to subscribe. So that way you guys don't miss out any content that comes out here on my channel. So I appreciate you guys coming by and watching. And I'm going to, of course, finish up leveling up this. So I will happily, uh, you know, max this, this out to 80. And uh, hopefully I'll get lucky later on to get his card. Uh, but I hope you guys have fun with the new update patch. Because I know I did so far. And... Uh, I'm looking forward to do other little things on here in this game, but uh, until then, I'll catch you guys in the next episode. Until then, bye guys! <laughs>